the art of perverting justice, and of racism. How the Australian Judiciary and the High Court Australia conspire to pervert justice in covering up human rights violations. First they came for the communists, and I didn't speak up, because I wasn't a communist. Then they came for the Jews, and I didn't speak up, because I wasn't a Jew. Then they came for the Catholics, and I didn't speak up, because I was a Protestant. Then they came for me, and by that time there was no one left to speak up for me. Reading and Understanding Statute The International Covenant on Civil and Political Rights was enacted as a federal law by the Labour Party with Liberal Party support as Schedule 2 to the Human Rights and Equal Opportunity Commission Act 1986. The Commonwealth of Australia Constitution Act 1900. The first statute has two supremacy clauses. S5 Commonwealth of Australia Constitution Act 1900 makes every federal law supreme. And S109 makes them prevail over all state enactments. The Act's Interpretation Act 1901. The second statute says a schedule is part of an act. A statute. The Judiciary Act 1903. The third statute says that the common law shall prevail, in S80 Judiciary Act 1903. The Human Rights and Equal Opportunity Commission Act 1986. The fourth statute makes it a common law crime to disobey a statute, for example, by misleading and deceiving the good people of Australia, thus becoming criminals. The fourth statute specifically implements the International Covenant on Civil and Political Rights. The Trade Practices Act 1974. The fifth statute refers to the International Covenant on Civil and Political Rights, not just in its dictionary, but in three offenses in Schedule Section 3. In the fifth statute, in Section 138 3F Evidence Act 1995, we are told where to find the International Covenant on Civil and Political Rights. Faces of Discrimination and Racism President of Human Rights and Equal Opportunity Commission John Von Dusa refused to investigate human rights violations, refused to terminate complaints so that they can be heard in the federal courts. High Court Australia Chief Justice Robert Shenton French Kenneth Madison Hayne Susan Marie Crennan William Montague Charles Gamow as federal court judge, French and others abuse and pervert justice by relying on fabricated documents not listed in the appeals book index. Hain tries to cover up French's abuse of the legal process by modifying an originating application for a writ of mandamus against French and others. Crennan and Gummo have been trying to cover up for their judicial mates by refusing questions of law to be heard in the high court. Prime Minister Kevin Rudd promptly appoints French not only as a High Court judge, but as the Chief Justice, nullifying the separation of the judiciary from executive influence. Questions of Law Whether the Human Rights and Equal Opportunity Commission Act 1986 and the Racial Discrimination Act 1975 are valid, and implementing the International Covenant on Civil and Political Rights under Australian laws. Heary, North, Marshall, Gray J.J. Federal Court Australia have labelled the Human Rights and Equal Opportunity Act 1986 a general rule. President of the Human Rights and Equal Opportunity Commission refused to report human rights violations of the Commonwealth as required under the Human Rights and Equal Opportunity Act 1986. White Australia Policy What are these judges trying to cover up? Perverting justice by Administrative Appeals Tribunal senior member John Handley and other members. Fabricating evidence by counsel Tim de Uray and Paul Mentor of Spark Helmore. Human rights violations by Commonwealth statutory bodies, including Human Rights and Equal Opportunity Commission and President John Von Dusa. All up and down the judicial chain, crooked judges covering up for their mates in perverting justice, and denying the existence of the Human Rights and Equal Opportunity Act 1986. Violations of the Rule of Law International Laws International Covenant on Civil and Political Rights 
International Covenant on the Elimination of All Forms of Racial Discrimination International Covenant on Economic, Social, and Cultural Rights Rome Statutes of the International Criminal Court Commonwealth of Australia Laws The Commonwealth of Australia Constitution Act 1900 The Act's Interpretation Act 1901 The Judiciary Act 1903 the Human Rights and Equal Opportunity Commission Act 1986 The Trade Practices Act 1974 The Criminal Code Act 1995 The Privacy Act 1988 The Evidence Act 1995 Australians of all backgrounds being made slaves A 70-year-old dying grandmother Tran was denied palliative care, as judges deny court application Mrs. Zhang refused court application for unfair dismissal. Mr. Pham denied court application for questions of law and racism. Physical and psychological abuse of Cornelia Rao and Vivian Solon. Physical and psychological abuse of John Wilson and common law rights. Physical and psychological abuse of Aborigines Nation in black deaths in custody and racist anti-intervention. Others being covered up by President of Human Rights and Equal Opportunity Commission John Von Dusa. KangarooCourtAustralia.com You can read and find out more information at KangarooCourtAustralia.com